Hello guys and welcome back to another video in the last hour some big breaking news coming regarding the show where actress Morford Clark and Gladwell actress Morford Clark has revealed quite a few things about the new Amazon Laundrings TV series and also I'd like to say this is the most an actress as actress from the cast has come out and talked about the show and there's quite a lot of things that we're going to be covering that she has said. So the first thing, while well, the title of the article is The Lord of the Rings star Morford Clark says this show is continually mind blowing. So the first of many things that she has said is that it was very clear that I needed to stay here, she said via Zoom. And also said, I've certainly been homesick, but it's a really small cost to bear in comparison to what's going on at the moment. And of course she's referring to the impact COVID-19 has had on people's lives. She goes on to say, it's definitely strange going into lockdown with the people that you've just started working with. But I think we all need to treat each other like family. Sure, you will occasionally get annoyed by people, but you still like them because you don't have a choice. And she's also talking about how the time she spent in the class will be useful on set. But the interesting thing is that she said she's going to worry about what we will see through their eyes about what they filmed pre-lockdown. So that's pretty interesting. So what she's trying to say is that us viewers will see the difference, maybe between the chemistry between them, what they shot pre-lockdown and after lockdown, because during, during lockdown they actually bonded much more apparently of course that's most likely going to be the case then when they come back they have better chemistry on set and on screen and that's going to be noticeable so that's quite interesting that she has said that so the first thing that she's gone on to say is that i don't think things could get much bigger than the lord of the rings and she is indeed correct and it says despite a lack of actual contact morphids friends and family back home have been played an important part in getting her ready for the role of young Galadriel. Of course, there's not a young Galadriel, but move on. And the quote she actually said is that, My friends love the Lord of the Rings. Whenever they came back home to Cardiff from university and I came back from drama school, we'd hibernate in one house and watch all three films back to back. Well, hopefully it's the extended edition then, because that's when it'd be all right. I'm joking. But she also goes on to say, but when I told them I'd be hired for the series, they were like, oh, really? I can't. I'm probably rambling on here, I think you can read the rest of that, but from, from this what we can tell is that she does have a deep connection and love for the films as she did watch them back in university and she does, like, she does have a passion for it which is good, that's good that an actress playing Galadriel has watched the film trees. maybe she could learn stuff from Clay Bancher who played Galadriel in the Jackson movies as well. Now just a little context for the next bit is that she's in fact talking about remember when Elijah Wood a few weeks ago was talking about doing a possible cameo and about that she said quote those films are so iconic for me I've actually been suppressing what I know about the Tolkien universe since I came out here says Clark. I honestly just love the idea that Elijah Wood has said that because I'm such a fan. I'd love everyone to do a cameo in it. That's I'm 50-50 on that as well. It's so nice to hear support for the series from someone like that and of course that is great seeing the old cast and the new cast for the show bonding. Now here is the most interesting bit where she says, I feel like I've got my fix of the massive stuff by doing Lord of the Rings. The amount of people working on the show is continually mind blowing. One guy's job consists of just seeing how dust reacts to footsteps and breath. So that's, that's good. I, I doubt, can't really comment on that. That is really interesting. <laughs> That would never even cross my mind before. But at least the good thing is that there is p attention to small detail, which is great. But you would expect a billion dollar project. Other than that, something like Marvel, I don't think something could get much bigger than this. And she is probably correct with that as well. So overall, the things I think we should take away from this is that, firstly, the comment she made about that the fans might be able to see a difference between the things they recorded pre-lockdown and post-lockdown. I think she meant that due to the fact that pre-lockdown they weren't as bonded or connected together but during lockdown during that six month period and um, the hiatus they bonded and gelled really well and now when they're going to come back and record again and currently recording you're going to see a much bigger difference between how how they there may be the chemistry on screen so that's quite interesting and the second thing is that how much up attention to detail Amazon are paying to the show as we are seeing a guy literally just seeing how dust reacts to people walking and their breath as well i think so it's quite interesting but thank you guys for watching i really appreciate it hope you guys enjoyed until the next video my friends goodbye